Hello everyone, this is Napa Valley Mommy. Welcome to the review video of Los Agaves restaurant here in Napa. This is a newer restaurant located in downtown Napa and they offer high-end Mexican food. Um, as you can see here, these are some of the dishes that we ordered. Um, in the end, um, I will talk about each dish individually and then let you know which one I enjoyed the most. So here is downtown Napa and the restaurant is located at the riverfront. So on one side you have all the downtown businesses and on the other side um, you'll have the Napa River. It's located literally right next to the famous riverfront Napa chair and this is their outdoor seating. It has little market lights which is probably really beautiful at night. They have really colorful chairs, which makes it look very inviting and vibrant. Um, Eye-catching, um, they have blue cups, a different color, um, festive chairs and heaters outside. So this is the front door. When you walk in, you'll see um, a lot of plants that are hanging. Um, it looks really festive. I love this bar area with the hanging lights and the colored bar. Um, on the table, you'll see fresh flowers. Here is the menu. Here is the table set up with the wine glass. And just above our table, there was a really pretty flower overlay. Um, with each meal, they offer chips and salsa. And this is the drink that I ordered. I'll go more into detail with it. At the end of this at the end of the video this is the burrilla tacos with the consomme the guacamole a little overview bird's eye view here is the queso fundido a little close-up and then when you eat the burrito tacos, I pulled it in half and you can see there's the queso that um, stretches and it looks super delicious and wanting to eat it. Here's the guacamole. A little dip into the queso fundita, extra stringy. Love it. another dip to do it justice here is the tacos al pastor with rice and beans all right so now that we took a look at what we had on the table let's talk about individually what we ordered now with each meal comes chips and salsa and I would say the chips were pretty firm and the salsa had a really nice kick to it. I then ordered um, the pineapple agua fresca, which um, I would say was really good. It wasn't too sweet. It was just nice and fresh with a subtle pineapple flavor. Um, I also shared it with my kiddo um, who loved it. The next was the guacamole. I would say that the guacamole is good. Um, it was really, um, fresh with that natural avocado. Um, you can tell that it was made that day and it wasn't pre-prepared. It came with jalapenos and diced onions. Um, the next thing we ordered was the queso fundido, which was really creamy and really stringy. And I just loved dipping it in the chips, adding a little guacamole on top, a little salsa on top to make that perfect bite. The next thing we ordered was the birria tacos. I think I spelled it wrong here, but you know what I mean. Um, it was really, I really liked it. It was full of meat. I love the consomme, dipping it just made it really tasty and juicy. And then the last thing that we ordered was the tacos al pastor plate, which came with rice and beans and two tacos. Um, I would say that the pork was really, really good with that pineapple. So this was our food spread. We had drinks, we had appetizers, we had entrees. Um, all of them were, I would say, really good. Um, they were fancy. Um, 
and I would say we had a well-rounded meal. Um, I definitely had a fan favorite and my date also had a fan favorite, but mine was the queso fundido. This was really the best item on the menu for me out of all the things that we ordered. What I really loved about it was that the cheese was super melty. It came with shiitake mushrooms or some type of mushroom. I'm not sure if it was shiitake, but um, mushrooms and chorizo. And so it really felt like, how should I say this? A deconstructed queso taco or quesadilla um, that you can just build your own. I liked mixing it with the guacamole, adding a little salsa on top. It was just super, super good. My date really loved the burrito tacos, um, which also had that cheesy goodness. So I want to say that overall, we had a good experience at Los Agaves um, here in Napa. We found out uh, about them through their food truck, and now they have a storefront. So I believe that they still have their food truck running. So go ahead and check them out. Um, support uh, their business. Um, it seemed like they were working really hard. They were pretty busy on the day that we went. If you liked this review and want to hear more reviews of the Napa restaurants in our area, feel free to subscribe. And we look forward to bringing you along next time to our next restaurant review.